Hey, this is Anthony with Revzilla TV, where you can watch, decide, and ride. Welcome to our detailed breakdown of the new Revit Neptune GTX Gore-Tex jacket, available at Revzilla.com. So new for 2013, we see the Neptune, a welcomed addition in the Revit lineup. The Neptune is going to be, really in my opinion, the successor to the Legacy, but a few key changes are going to make it a staple in this line. So you're looking right around that $600 mark. This is going to be the Gore-Tex big brother of something like the Sand. It has two LTD liners inside, so you have your outer shell, you have your Gore Pack Light liner, waterproof, breathable, guaranteed for life, and then interior of that you have your thermal liner. So that gives you your three season cold, it gives you your fall, your winter, and your spring. Now the beauty of the Neptune, what the Legacy did not have, is that this has six major direct vents which are going to allow you to get a fourth season, the summer weight riding season. This bad boy is going to vent as well, if not better than something like the Revit Sand. So you're going to have two big vents along the front two events along the arms. I'm not going to show you just yet, but when I turn Joe backwards, you're going to see back vents vertically that allow with the liners out full direct ventilation throughout the garment. Again, in a beefy outer shell construction, and you have three or four colors available. There's a black, this is silver, there's anthracite, there's also a high-vis version accent, or high-vis accent version here available as well. Now, once you know how this is positioned with the line, and remember, you're going to step up from here to something like Defender or something like the Poseidon GTX, which are really Apex products in the Revit line, let's talk about fitment. Joe, six foot, 199, 199, 195, around a 40, 41 inch chest. He's wearing a size large. Now, in the last few years, we've seen Revit sizing kind of do this a little bit, depending on the model. This is going to fit right in line with something like the Defender. It's going to be what I would consider standard American cut with Joe wearing a size large. Again, no surprises here. And remember, we do ship for free over 39 bucks, no restock fees ever. And if you're not sure, give us a shout if you're concerned about the sizing. There's also a size chart on the page. Now, as I walk through some of the other key features here on the Neptune GTX, subscribe to us, Revzilla TV on our YouTube channel. Leave me comments, questions, feedback, gut reactions to any of the features I'm going to call out here as we kind of get into the weeds a little bit. So starting with our outer shell, it's a mixture of materials. You're going to have your main power shell construction from Revit, proprietary material, highly abrasion resistant around that 5600 denier mark. That's going to be your main light silver. Then you have a ripstop material and your impact areas, down the arms, sides of the shoulders, up here along the back. And you can see it really clearly in this black and silver version. You know, from there you get into some of the other creature comforts. Protection, CE rated pro-life armor. Pro-life is a big step up from Knox light armor. Pro-life armor in the shoulders, in the elbows, in forearms. And this jacket would take a C-soft Revit Type RV back protector insert that you can purchase separately. Now we've already talked about the ventilation. But one of the cool things here is you have these snaps that live inside these pockets that allow your chest ventilation here that's backed by 3D mesh to stay open and that 3D mesh allows some space between the outer shell of the garment and your body so the air has room to circulate. Again, nice touch. Looking at the rest of the front, you're going to see waterproof pockets here that actually have a wax trim on there, a wax cotton trim, which is nice. And then remember, Revit uses YKK zips, spring-loaded Fiocchi snaps. Again, it's high quality materials that last. Looking here at the collar, five-way adjustable collar snap. You kind of, it's the rompo peel of collars, set it and forget it. At some point, he's 90 years old, he's going to call and scream at me. But that's okay, I'm still going to call it that. And if we look at our leather rolled collar, you like that, the rompo peel line. It's good, he's an idol. So if you wrap around the collar, you're going to see it's nicely rolled and it's not going to chafe you. Now, Joe, what I want you to do is turn a face away from me. I want to walk through some of the side features here. Take a hair of a step back. There you go. Notice the reflectivity. Revit logo down the sleeve. Reflectivity, you're going to have cinching on the forearm that wraps all the way around. And then again, with these collars, or these cuffs rather, I'm going to close it up, open it this way, you're going to see here's my entry and exit point to the cuff and you can see the inner liners there as well. If I move Joe's arm out of the way, cinching along the hip and notice this is a hip length piece of gear so it goes all the way down. Turn the face completely backwards for me Joe, there you go, stop right there. Notice rabbit pouch here in the back to take your, your pack light or your thermal liner and that's a waterproof pocket, spring loaded snaps and then here are my back zips. Again, that complement the back nicely, full air throw throughout the back. And if you move up to the top, you're going to see your Gore-Tex logo there. But again, you can see the reflective panels in 3M Scotch light that's going to allow full reflectivity for nighttime riding. Come back around to the front for me, Joe. I just want to show here as well on the bicep, again, instead of using big cinches, they're actually using snaps for your volumetric adjustment. So you have the ability kind of to cinch everything down. And I guess I left his, I left your sleeve there. But again, there's set it and forget it on the cuff as well. Moving into the jacket. Big areas of Velcro go all the way down, big YKK zipper goes all the way down, and then as we open it up, now you're going to see your waterproofing. 
here's, and we have one side undone. You can hold that just like that, Joe. See, there's my Gore-Tex pack slate my Gore-Tex Packlight Technology inner liner, and it is finished, so it has a nice destination liner type feel. You can see the interior with all the liners out would be just a basic mesh for summertime riding, and there's a full spectrum of pockets in here as well. Looking at the collar, Trico lining, more Trico lining, so it's never gonna chafe you up at the top, and then there's how your entry and exit from the thermal works. So again, there's your flexibility. Some guys don't like the multi-liner system. They say, hey, just sell me a shell. I have base layers, I have mid layers. I'm gonna do what I want. With a jacket like this, you're gonna notice that you're getting everything off the rack you need for a multi-season adventure. You can see we even have it pa paired with the Neptune pants, but again, you have the ability to kind of work through it, different pockets, different options, as you move to the inside. And you'll notice too, I'm gonna to show you really quickly, because a lot of people ask me how it's connected at the bottom of the sleeve. Notice spring-loaded snaps down here at the sleeve as well. So they're not sacrificing any quality and you notice there's a red one which shows you which one's on the bottom, which one's the top. You're not sacrificing any quality when you start to move into the interior guts because again, for the type of rider this is geared to, which is multi-season sport, sport touring, multi-season dual sporting, you know, in that mid-range, you're gonna put a lot of miles on these. The other nice feature when you start talking about the dirt factor is these are Teflon, or Teflon coated, which means that it's highly abrasion resistant, but also it's not gonna take dirt and road grime. It's gonna create that almost molecular barrier that allows you in many cases to kind of with some basic care and maintenance, keep this guy looking a little bit cleaner for a little longer. Now I've opened all your pockets, I've undone all your liners, you look quite disheveled, don't get mad at me Revit. The next step in your journey, click right here, read rider reviews of the Neptune GTX at RevZilla.com. Remember, use my information as a starting point, but you don't have to take my word for it. We always ship for free, and as always, give our gear geeks a shout. If you want a gear geek, like Count Rukula here to my left to walk you through the gear lineup. Give us a shout. See us at RevZilla.com or 877-792-9455. Thanks for watching our detailed breakdown of the Neptune GTX from Revit. I'm Anthony. We'll see you next time.